Jack in the Box is teaming up with Marvel Studios to help cross-promote the awesome-looking Deadpool and Wolverine movie coming out this summer. And to help celebrate, I've got a variation of Deadpool's favorite snacks to go in on. That's right, everyone, so get ready for it, because up next I've got what they're calling the sauced and loaded Mini Chimmy Bang Bangs. As always, I'm Ian Kay, and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Well, this doesn't look too bad, guys, and I have to say, I think Deadpool would probably agree. This is looking pretty nice. Lots of crispy goodness with this one here. Let me break it on down for you fully before we get right into it. Yeah, they're definitely marketing Deadpool pretty much everywhere ahead of his movie with Wolverine coming out this summer, guys. Feast your eyes on the sauced and loaded mini chimmy bang bangs. What we've got here are three chimichangas, basically filled with shredded chicken, corn, black beans, and what they're calling Southwest flavors. And because this is sauced and loaded, it's gonna be topped off with two types of cheddar cheese, shredded lettuce, and taco sauce. So guys, a lovely situation here. Essentially, with these three little mini chimichangas, you've got a lot of loaded goodness to go in on with them for sure. So let's not waste any more time on this one because I'm sure Deadpool wants to get on with it. This is the sauced and loaded mini chimmy bang bangs over here at Jack in the Box. Let's peep out this flavor. Yeah, not a bad fast food situation with this one, guys. And considering Jack in the Box has some pretty tasty egg rolls as well as tacos, I guess it kind of fits to kind of go in with Jack in the Box for the movie. So let me pick up one of these and we'll get it going. And considering these are sauced and loaded, this is actually looking very, very nice. As you can see, the mini chimichanga root Deadpool, I think, would definitely agree. This is definitely looking pretty nice. Let's give this a shot. The sauced and loaded mini chimmy bang bangs here at Jack in the Box. Let's peep this out. Hmm. Okay. A little bit of Tex-Mex flavoring I'm getting with this one. Shredded cheese, the black beans. And naturally, with the cheddar cheese on the top, that is pretty tasty, guys. Again, a nice little gluttonous fast food situation. I think this would be kind of fun for late night. Crispy outer shell, a lovely situation. But you know what? I'm kind of wondering why they didn't do like beef on the inside, like a regular chimichanga. So I'm digging the chicken. It's a lighter option. It's not bad. And I have to admit, this is pretty tasty. Three of these for $4.50, or Solo Dolo without the sauce and loaded goodness for $3.50. So for the extra dollar, you're getting some extra flavor. That's not too bad. Let's keep going in. Mmm. Not bad. I guess with the lettuce, it kind of makes it a little bit more of a flair for crunch, which is not bad too. And again, on the inside, just a little bit of chicken, a little bit of black beans, the corn action. Not too bad. Let's keep going. Mm, tasty as a snack. It's not bad. All right, let's go for another one. And as you can see, definitely a very, very loaded situation. This is pretty nice. I think it's actually worth it um, to go with the lettuce and the taco sauce and naturally the cheese with this one, guys. Not bad, let's keep going in. Mmm. The taco sauce is nice with this. This is tasty. A little bit of sizzle, not bad. And again, as a cross promotion with Marvel Studios, naturally, I see you, Jack in the Box. I see you. This is a pretty nice situation with the crispy action here. So very reminiscent of their egg roll texture on this one here, but with that chicken action on the inside. So let's go for another couple of quick bites on this, guys. Very tasty and easily worth a dollar upgrade to go for the sauced and loaded version of these. I'm glad I got it actually like that instead of Solo Dolo. Let's keep going in. Mmm. These are tasty. Definitely tasty, definitely fun. Nice. So yeah, guys, a nice fun little movie tie-in, of course, and a lot of tasty goodness with this one as well. And I have to say, very nice in the overall presentation. And the crispiness is pretty decent as well. I mean, it's a little soft on the inside, as you'd expect, but the outer coating holds its composure for the most part, even though you've got a lot of stuff on the very top of this here. So let's go for one more bite, and we'll wrap this little quickie review with the rating coming up next. Hang on. Mmm. Well, I have a feeling this is going to be Deadpool approved, guys. We've got a nice little chimichanga situation over here and a very fun name calling these things the Chimmy Bang Bang. So it's got a lot of fun marketing to go with. And of course, with Deadpool and Wolverine coming out, I can't wait to see that movie. This is a very fun little tie-in for that and something easily worth going in on. And again, for the dollar upgrade over the regular 350, it's worth it for the extra cheesy taco sauce action. Definitely something to go in on and try. Order on Uber Eats, Postmates, and Grubhub.
So with that said, I'm going to have to give what they're calling the sauced and loaded mini chimmy bang bangs here at Jack in the Box a pretty decent 8.2 out of 10. It's a pretty tasty situation, guys, overall. And if there's one knock I can say with this particular one is the fact that I didn't get the promo packaging it's supposed to be in, naturally with Deadpool's face on the outside. That's a no-brainer. I'm surprised I didn't get that. Considering this is a digital exclusive for the next week or so until it goes official, I have to say, guys, it's definitely something to check out. Make sure you hit up the Jack in the Box app and check it out yourself. And naturally, let me know what you guys personally think of it as well. I'm very curious to hear your thoughts. Which is a fine little segue into me telling you guys to do just that. Drop some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of these sauced and loaded mini chimmy bang bangs. Do you like the name? And more importantly, what did you think of the overall flavor if you've given it a shot? Are you super excited about the Deadpool and Wolverine movie? I'm pretty excited myself. Let me know what you guys thought down below. Drop those comments and light it up. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I couldn't do it without you and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.